Hi, I'm Keith Bledsoe, and I'm the owner here at Smoky Mountain Traders. I personally go out and buy the best cars on the market for you, our customer. Please give us a call with any questions you may have. Hey everybody, it's Devin with Smoky Mountain Traders. I hope you're having a great day. Today we're going to be taking a close look at this 1969 Chevrolet Camaro Z28. Now this car is a true Z. It's an X77 car and it's had a complete frame off rotisserie restoration. Now if you've got any questions on this car, you can give us a call at 865-988-8088 or you can send us an email to sales at smtclassics.com. I'm going to take you around the outside, on the inside, and under the hood of this Z, and then we'll get it around there on a lift and out on the highway as well. As we look across the front, you'll notice the one year only design that the 69 Camaro has offered, and you'll notice that on this car, the bumpers and the emblems have been replaced, and it'll give you your first opportunity to look down the sides, and you'll see that they are aero straight. As you come on around the driver's side, you'll see that these body lines are as close to perfect as you could possibly ask for. Now you'll also notice that these door gaps are even and symmetrical, but before we go on around, I want you to come on up and we'll take a look on the inside of this Z. On the inside, it does have the black interior with the bucket seats, which is the factory option for this car. Looking across the dash, you'll notice that the speedometer and the gas gauge are in excellent condition. You can also see that it's got the factory style knob radio and that the dash pad appears to have been replaced at the time of resto. Coming on around, you can see that the door panels, seat covers, carpet, and the headliner are all like new, and that even the dome light is working in this car. Now that we've been on the inside, we'll continue on around the outside. They give you the opportunity to see how great that door shuts and fits. Now as we come across the back, you'll see the rear bumper has been replaced along with the bumper guards. Now this car does have the correct spooler on the back, and you can see that this Le Mans blue paint is accented by the white stripes. As you come on around the passenger side, I'll take a step back so that way you can take a closer look at the paint finish on this car. When it was restored, it was done in the base coat quick coat, and the Le Mans blue is the factory option for this car. Now as you can see, it's been buffed and polished to a gorgeous shine, and you'll also notice that it's got the 15 inch rally wheels with the Goodyear wide tread GT tires. The outside of this Camaro is absolutely stunning along with the interior, but under the hood is what's really going to be impressive to you. So if you'll come on up, we'll take a look at the heartbeat of this Chevrolet. Now this car is a factory Z28, and under the hood it offers the numbers matching DZ302 engine. Everything has a gorgeous detail under here, and you'll also notice that that 302 has a factory winner's intake and the holly carb that it's supposed to, and for exhaust manifolds, those are the correct option as well. Now that we've been around the outside, on the inside, and under the hood of this Z, I'll get it pulled around there so that way you can take a closer look at this rotisserie restoration. Remember, if you've got any questions, you can give us a call at 865-988-8088, or you can send us an email to sales at smtclassics.com. Now let's get it around there so that way you can take a closer look at the bottom, and then we'll get it out on the highway for you as well. Now that we have this 16 on the rack, we can take a closer look at what makes this car such a special opportunity. We have pictures of this car before and during the restoration that show how solid it truly is. Now during the rotisserie restoration, it was cleaned and painted back like it would have been from the factory. Under the front, it had all the ball joints and bushings changed, and the matching numbers 302 engine is mated to the Muncie 4-speed trans and the 12-volt posi rear end with around a 355 gear. For exhaust, it has the dual pipes with a stock style muffler that's above the rear end. Out back, you can see the gas tank was replaced along with the fuel lines and the brake lines. Before we get this Z28 on the road, let's take a close look at the floors, rockers, and frame, and we can see how clean and solid they all are.
Thanks for visiting us at SmokyMountainTraders.com. If you're ever in East Tennessee, stop by and check us out. Ah!